Greetings, my Antonat. I'm Mark Thomas, your traveling anthropologist. In our previous show, we unwrapped a Filipino Christmas celebration. Now we'll play Brazilian football. But first, we have breaking news. How did the legendary football player Pele get his name? We'll pass the answer to you at the end of this video. Bem-vindo ao Brasil. While you vacation here, you will want to explore the social diversity this amazing country has to offer. From its indigenous roots which blend into their Portuguese heritage, a great introduction to understanding the Brasileiros is through their favorite sport called futebol. In fact, they call Brazil o país de futebol, meaning the country of football. This beautiful activity, also known as soccer, is the most popular game in the world. A contributing factor to this is the sport's simplicity. Teammates may set up a football playing field, officially called a pitch, just about anywhere and can make a football out of nearly anything. Once the opposing goal markers are positioned, the playful battle begins, ultimately leading to goal! Futubal's ubiquity gives you a chance to see an exciting match all around the country from amateur up to professional. Brazil was introduced to this sport in April 1894 by Scottish-born transplant Thomas Donahoe. Since then, it flourishes in the state clubs onto the world stage where every four years, the Federación Internacional de Futebol Asociación, aka FIFA, holds the World Cup. Brazil has won it five times, more than any other country. So, if you want to make some friends here, be sure to attend a game during your trip, but make sure to support the locals because Brazilians are very passionate about their favorite team. I went to Rio de Janeiro's Maracanã Stadium, which happens to be the largest one in all Brazil. It was built to host the 1950 World Cup, and it's the site of Pele's 1,000th goal. Also, he is considered the greatest football player of all time. He begins his career at 15 years of age playing for the nearby Santos Football Club. Then he joins the Brazilian national team the following year. Ever since then, he has become a shining example to the sports world, focusing on helping underprivileged children to excel not only in football, but in life as well. Once you have interacted with the Brazilian people here, you will see that football pervades their entire social fabric, from the youngest to the oldest members. It will also have a profound effect on your visit to Brazil. Now, back to our breaking news. Earlier we asked, how did the legendary football player Pele get his name? He was nicknamed after his favorite goalkeeper, Vasco da Gama Bile. If you got a kick out of this episode, then please like, comment, and share it. And then score more points at my page, anthronauts.com. See you next time for another exciting traveling culture show. I'm Mark Thomas for Anthronauts. Ciao and hui awa. Mm -hmm.